get ready english senior second paper trial dictation 15 seconds 10 seconds Five seconds. Start. Speaking in the Legislative Assembly on the Governor's address, an Honorable Member said, Mr. Speaker, Sir, I welcome the Chief Minister's assurance that the Government will take necessary steps to see that decisions are taken as quickly as possible so that there may be no complaint of a delayed decision. One such issue is the farmers' demands regarding a remunerative price for their produce. I would request the government to produce during the course of the budget session a white paper on the demands of the farmers because we do not know what exactly the demands are, what the financial implications are likely to be in what form relief is requested by the farmers, the request made by the state government to the central government regarding the rescheduling of debts and writing off of interest and a variety of other demands and solutions should be embodied in the white paper so that we may have an opportunity to discuss these in detail during the budget session. On one matter, I think the farmers are justified in feeling aggrieved and that is that in spite of an increase in the price of fertilizers and an increase in the price of diesel, an immediate announcement has not been made by the Agricultural Prices Commission or the Government of India regarding an enhancement in the procurement price of agricultural produce in Tamil Nadu. Get ready. English short and senior condensation and elaboration part. Code number of the question paper 1673. 1673. The passage will be dictated at the rate of 120 words per minute. You are requested to take down the following passage in the reporting style of phonography and condense it into a summary of about 200 words with a suitable heading and subheadings using the indirect form of speech and the past tense. The number of words should be counted and noted at the end of the summary. Five marks are reserved for your shortened performance. Your handwriting should be legible and that sufficient space should be left between lines. Get ready for main dictation. 15 seconds. Five seconds. Start. Speaking on the performance budget, the Honorable Minister for Backward Classes, Most Backward Classes and Minorities Welfare said, Mr. Speaker, Sir, I take this opportunity to say a few words regarding the welfare scheme that has been implemented in my department. The government of Tamil Nadu is implementing various welfare schemes for the benefit of backward classes, most backward classes, denotified communities and minorities as education is basic for social and economical advancement. The government is making significant budget allocation for implementation of various educational schemes. The Tamil Nadu Backward Classes Economic Development Corporation was formed for the economic development of the people belonging to backward classes, most backward classes, 
and denotified communities in the state the reservation policy of the government enables the persons belonging to backward classes most backward classes and denotified communities to secure admission in the educational institutions and to get employment in state government for their social and economical advancement the government grant scholarships to students of pre metric post metric 3 year degree courses diploma courses in polytechnics professional degree courses and various other courses so as to enable them to continue education a scheme of sanctioning scholarship to the students belonging to these communities of tamil nadu studying undergraduate and postgraduate courses in listed central institutes and central universities all over india including tamil nadu is being implemented by the government the government of india scholarship schemes for other backward classes is also implemented in tamil nadu hostels are functioning in various parts of the state for the stay of the students who are going to school from far off places to continue their studies yearly four sets of uniforms are provided to the students up to 10th standard the food charges for school boarders and college boarders are borne by the government in addition to that the government provides special food to the inmates of school and college hostels during festivals such as pongal republic day tamil new year independence day and deepavali i would like to inform that in addition to this monthly miscellaneous charges such as for soap toothpaste has been sanctioned to school and college hostel boarders the government is providing boarding grants for 10 months in a year to the students of backward classes most backward classes and denotified communities staying in the government recognized private hostels subject to the condition that their annual parental income does not exceed 2 lakhs in order to encourage the wardens matrons and other staff to maintain the hostels in a hygienic manner shield and memento are awarded to the best three hostels and cash prizes are awarded to the staff of these hostels bicycles are supplied at free of cost to those students studying in 11th standard in government government aided and partly aided schools without any income ceiling except for students staying in hostels situated in the school premises and students of residential schools the government is honoring those who make outstanding contribution for social justice in tamil nadu with tandai periyar award for social justice every year the award is selected by the honorable chief minister every year the award is awarded a gold medal of one sovereign and a cash prize of rupees 1 lakh the cash prize of rupees 1 lakh has been increased to rupees 5 lakhs from the previous financial year onwards thus the award is awarded a gold medal of one sovereign and a cash prize of rupees 5 lakhs with these words i thank you all for giving me this opportunity and conclude my speech with the hope that i have done my best
get ready this is section 2 matter for elaboration dictation time 4 minutes passage is dictated at the rate of 1 to 2 words per minute you are requested to take down in shorthand the notes or imaginary letters that will be dictated to you you should elaborate into longhand in proper documentary form for signature wherever required 5 marks are reserved for your shortened performance. Your handwriting during elaboration should be legible and that sufficient space should be left between lines. Get ready. 15 seconds. Five seconds. Start. One. Commissioner Salem City. Municipal Corporation Salem invites sealed tenders for the construction of security room, toilet and raising of compound wall at non-gazetted government officials colony Salem. Estimated cost of work is rupees 79 lakhs. Earnest money deposit is rupees 79,000 by means of demand draft of any nationalized bank drawn in favor of the chief accounts officer. Salem City Municipal Corporation, Salem, payable at Salem. Tenders will be received up to 20th May 2022 at 3 p.m. and will be opened on the same day at 3.30 p.m. Tender documents can be added from the corporation's website up to 19th May 2022. The commissioner reserves right to accept or reject any or all tenders without any reason thereof. Draft a tender notice. 2. Registrar Tamil Nadu Open University Anna Salai Saidapet Chennai invites application to engage full time assistant professor on contract with purely temporary basis. Applicant must possess master degree in any discipline and master degree in education with not less than 55 percentage of marks. Selected candidates will be paid. Consolidate pay of rupees 25,000 per month. Maximum age limit is 50 years. Duration of contract is one year, which may be extended at the discretion of the university. Selection is on the basis of return test followed by interview. Application accompanying proof of educational qualification, age, and experience, if any, should reach the registrar on or before. 17 4 2022 at 5 pm detailed notification and application can be downloaded from the university's website up to 16 4 2022 draft advertisement 3 Pundamalli i road is one of the busiest roads in chennai there is four road junction in this part in which there is no traffic signal due to this accidents are occurring frequently pedestrians feel it is difficult to cross the road. Students who are studying in the government and private schools of this area cross the road with fear. Recently, an accident occurred due to collision of two wheelers face to face in which there is no loss of life. It will be highly useful if a traffic signal is erected in this junction. Draft a letter to the editor of the leading daily. The Hindu requesting to publish the above news in the newspaper. 4. On 17th May 2022 evening, a private bus coming from Yadapadi collided with a college bus coming from Tirchangot. The driver and passengers were thrown off their seats as the bus came to a sudden stop. In that accident, 18 people, including both the bus drivers and passengers were injured and all of them have been rushed to nearby hospitals for treatment. But luckily, there was no loss of life. It was said that the collision appeared to be the fault of the college bus driver who drove the bus in a negligent manner. On receiving the information about the accident, police rushed to the spot and were inquiring about the accident, draft an eyewitness account.